A gamer here, and I just want to do a little breakdown of the images posted on uh, Black Ops 2 official website, Call of Duty slash Black Ops 2. The first image is uh, called Claw. I'm guessing they're talking about this tank or whatever it is. I really don't know why it's called Claw. If you look behind it, you see a car. I guess that's what is it? it looks like a Toyota. I don't really know. Anyway, that should get a rep. That should give a rep representation. There we go. I said it. That should give a representation of how big this thing is. From the looks of it, it's, I guess, exactly the same size as the car, only with the legs. So I'm guessing it's maybe at least uh, 8, no, yeah, a little, around 8 feet tall, and maybe uh, its main body is the size of, a, I guess, a small SUV. Alright, so let's, let's look at the weapons. We have, uh, I guess, a standard milli, 8 millimeter or machine gun. I don't really understand how bullets work, or guns. So we have a machine gun, and from the looks of it, a nuke tube, or I guess, whatever that is. I guess that could be its standardized, uh, what do you call it? I guess that could be its main gun to shoot the bigger bullets. On top, what it looks like, it's uh, a mini SAM turret. I really don't know. I, I can't really tell if that's a blast from the tank or from the building behind it. But it definitely has some scope, so I'm guessing that's how the people inside it look outside. Now this vehicle looks really fun to drive, so I'm guessing 100% it's going to be in the campaign. I'm guessing you're going to be behind the wheel shooting stuff, blowing stuff up. It's going to be much fun. Now, some background stuff. There's a building here, I guess, whatever that is. More buildings and Zelva, whatever that is. Next image is called the Quad Rotor Overwatch. The Quad Rotor, I'm guessing, is uh, these vehicles right there and there. Uh, we have a picture of some guy wearing armor or whatever it is, holding a gun. From the looks of it, it looks like a FAMAS, because in Modern Warfare 2, the FAMAS had this little bridge right here with the iron sights up there, so it could be a FAMAS, but doesn't really look like it. Anyway, so what we have here is quad rotors. What I'm guessing is um, they're pretty much like chop, no, not chopper gunners, attack helicopters from Black Ops, because they are pretty small. They don't seem to be um, man-controlled. They seem to be robots. So they pretty much are going to be just attack, heli attack helicopters with this gun 360. Pretty much is going to work exactly like the same thing as an attack helicopter. I'm not really 100% sure. Some more stuff is that there's a uh, spy planes above. I really don't know what that is. Could be just fighter jets flying around. From the looks of this, he looks to be a U.S. soldier given that his uh, tag looks... It looks like he has the eagle on it. And right here, I think that's the United States flag. This could be just a standard trooper for like... Black Ops 2, the, san the standard soldier that will be helping you out in the fights. So this is a close-up look of the quad rotor, which is actually the title of the image. Again, it doesn't seem to be controlled by anybody. It looks like to be a, an AI, So and it does look just like an attack helicopter, only with, I guess, four rotors. I don't know. Same thing with the 360, a, a gun. From the looks of it, it looks like it's attacking the enemy. Or, it looks like Russians wearing the standardized mask. Guess those are the enemies in the game. In the background, you see a building destroyed, more buildings destroyed, another uh, spy plane. From the looks of it, a stealth bomber from Modern Warfare 2. That's what it looks like, except it's going a little bit too fast in order to be stealth bomber, which is interesting. Alright, given that the, this quad rotor is next to this truck, it does seem that the size of this thing is at least uh, small as a, as a small car, or a size of a a regular attack helicopter only that it has four blades the title of this picture is called Harper which I'm guessing is this guy he looks a lot like Woods given that he has blue eyes and um, tattoos all over his body or not body his arm however Woods does have like a tattoo on his left arm which he doesn't have so I'm guessing it's not Woods so I'm guessing this is a new main character you're gonna be playing as named Harper he's also holding I'm guessing a a FAMAS. Either that or it's an ACR. That's what it looks like to me anyway. My prediction for this guy is that he's either Woods' son, given that the, the trailer is, is, seems like Woods is giving a speech to somebody else about his past. So it could be his son and Woods talking about his son in the war, which could make sense. In the background, you see uh, two soldiers without their helmets, I guess. Apparently... This person is a civilian, so I'm guessing in the campaign you're going to have to some missions of escort of escorting civilians to safety. All right, coming back to Harper, you see that his radio, or looks like a cell phone, is on his right arm, which I really don't know how that's going to help. And his left arm is apparently a, a map. 
In the trailer, you see this entire thing as a map. So I'm guessing in the game, if you push start, your character will pretty much just look at it and see the entire map, plus maybe maybe some menu options, which is actually a lot more in depth than just regular pause button. This image is titled Los Angeles, which it sort of doesn't look anything like Los Angeles. I should know I live here. However, it is in the future, so I'm guessing just buildings. This looks like downtown LA because there's a whole bunch of buildings there. This looks a lot like a Modern Warfare 3 scene given that uh, United States is being attacked by whoever. Buildings are on fire, stuff is being destroyed, and apparently you've, instead of fighting in Washington DC, we're fighting on the other side of the, the entire map which is Los Angeles. This is a very nice picture of Harper's, a little close up, let's see what he has for gear, let's see. Those look like flashbangs, not 100% sure, his ammo is over here, uh, that looks like a grenade, not 100% sure. Another, uh, his gun is a FAMAS. I really don't know what his gun is. I really want to know. What is that? Futuristic FAMAS or an ACR? I really do not know. However, he does look a lot like Woods. So I'm still I'm still predicting that Woods in the trailer was talking about the past of whoever was interviewing him. Probably about his son being in the war. So it's a, little, a lot like Black Ops where you start off like in the future. Huh. Ironic. You start off in the future and pretty much just Woods is telling about the past. So a little recap of what I learned of uh, the... Claw is apparently a vehicle the size of a car, which is going to be 100% in the game, and you're going to be behind the wheel shooting at stuff. The quad rotor, which I'm guessing is going to be like the standardized attack helicopters, I'm going to be 100% sure also that it's going to be a kill streak for multiplayer, because it pretty much looks like an attack helicopter 360 gun. It doesn't look like it's manned. However, in the trailer, there was this one scene where you were piloting something that was not um, a sh not an aircraft, but something more maneuverable, which I'm guessing is that. But other than that, that's all I got for this.